Hey family, welcome back to yet another edition of the Oppo Noti Vasti Solution. In this video, I'm going to be showing you the details of what's inside this Lenovo E14 ThinkPad laptop. Showing you how to upgrade or rather dismantle, disassemble this Lenovo E14 generation or tool ThinkPad laptop. How to dismantle, how to disassemble, how to replace and upgrade RAM how to replace and upgrade battery, how to replace the hard drive or rather the SSD and what is inside it. Join me as you go through right away without wasting any of our time. Cheers. So starting right away, we have uh, our Phillips screwdriver here that's, that we are going to be using and also a presser tool that we are going to be using. So starting right away, we have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven screws that we need to unscrew and open up the laptop. So let's start with this one. Screw number one. Go to screw number two. Go to screw number three. Screw number four. Then screw number five. Screw number six. And then screw number seven. So once we have loosened all the screws, we need to get our presser tool, a plastic presser tool, but in this case, me, I'm having a metallic one. But in case you're having a metallic one, you have to be very, very careful because it might damage your laptop. So I'm going to be using the metallic one and I'm going to be gentle while using the metallic one. So you have to also be gentle. So you go to the sides, extreme side, extreme corner. That's where you press your presser tool and then keep moving it gently and gently and gently as you flip open as you flip open the cover you just keep moving you just keep moving your pressure tool as you flip open the cover so here at the back side at the back side here that's why you have to be keen because it still opens from the top. So you have to keep removing. Keep flipping, flipping the cover until you get rid of the cover. So this is our cover and we have opened it successfully. So at the interior or rather inside, inside here, uh, you can see it has uh, a cooling fan which has two pipes that control or rather uh, push aeration into the processor to enable cooling of the entire system. And then we have, uh, first things first, remember we've, we are always encouraged to first disconnect the internal battery or disconnect of the power that is entering the motherboard or the laptop. So in this case, we need to first disconnect this battery. This is our battery, which is a, uh, a 45 watts what's our battery capacity so we need to unscrew or open it up rather disconnect it from the motherboard so in case you want to replace or rather upgrade your battery you are always encouraged to first disconnect and this is the disconnect the connection point onto the motherboard so we need to disconnect this but before we do that, let's first unscrew. And unscrewing this battery, it has one, two, three, four, five screws that we need to get rid of, or rather loosen as we remove the battery. So starting right away, we are removing screw number one, screw number two, screw number three, screw number four, and then screw number five. So once we are done with this unscrewing, we can then remove the battery. But before we remove it, we need to first disconnect it off the motherboard. So we disconnect it first by removing the connector. So this is our battery. In case you want, in case it's an old one, you can always replace it. But remember, it holds up to 45 watts hours battery capacity, which is this one. So in case you want to always change this, that's how you can go by that. So moving on, uh, 
it has our CMOS battery which is here so in case this one is expired and you would like to replace you can always just disconnect it off from here but after removing the battery so that is it well, when you go to the storage it has a it has a RAM slot here which is covered by a metal bracket uh, which fits up to 32 GB of DDR4 uh, memory so let's first uh, in case you want to upgrade you can always first uh, remove this one screw which is holding the metallic metal bracket covering the RAM slot so I can unscrew this and uh, remove this metal bracket gently gently to have access to where the RAM sits this is the metallic metal uh, me sorry this is the metal bracket that covers this RAM slot or rather the RAM sticks which is of uh, DDR4 memory and in case you want to upgrade this RAM, this RAM you can always just uh, remove it gently and then upgrade it, it fits up to a capacity of 300 GB and uh, this one which is right here is uh, actually 8 GB so you can see you can always upgrade to a bigger version of RAM that you wish to upgrade to but the capacity that it holds is up to 32 GB that's 32 gigabytes so we're moving on uh, going to another storage unit it has a uh, it has two M.2 PCIe slots. Uh, it has this one and this one. So it has two PCIe slots, number one and number two. So the first one, the first one that we have here has a length of, uh, it's a smaller one, a shorter one. It has a length of 42 uh, millimeters. Then this other one, which is, uh, which has having our SSD uh, drive uh, is having a capacity or rather a length of 80, 80 millimeters long so in case we want to upgrade our SSD we can always just uh, remove it or in case we want to just upgrade we can always add this one and and another we can always add another one here on top of this one which is already connected so you can always unscrew this one which is having one screw and then replace in case you want to replace or in case you want to do anything with it you can always do it so this is our ssd and uh this one um, if i may say it's uh having 500 gb so in case you want to upgrade to maybe one terabyte you can always do the same or in case you want to have two of these but uh, with shorter length you can always put one here and one there so moving on Moving on, we have our wireless card here, which is connected directly onto the motherboard. So moving on, uh, we have uh, the speakers. It has two double speakers. Yeah, it has this speaker and this one. So if you have to follow the line that connects that connects the sound speakers, it's, it comes up to here. So in case you want to connect or rather replace the speakers, you can always use this. Uh, you can always disconnect it from here off the motherboard and then do the replacement as you wish to uh, in case this one dies off you can always replace then moving on there is this connection which is uh, connecting the screen onto the motherboard so it's it's it, it's what it, it works for the display so in case you're having a problem with the screen or you want to replace your screen you can always just disconnect it off here I will show you a video of a uh, changing and replacing screen in another version i will later on show you so that's it for this in case you need to upgrade that is how you can do so let's just put our items back in case we are replacing the ram we can always put back our ram just like this connect the put back the metallic bracket just gently So you put back this screw, you get the screw and then tighten it 
here so that the metal bracket is intact then also put back our ssd storage device back into its sitting position then get its screw that holds it firmly onto the board then tighten it there so once we are done we can also get our battery and put it back so remember it has five screws so we put back the screws to attach the battery onto the motherboard gently tighten the screws onto the motherboard so once we are done we can later then connect 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 the battery into the board once we are done with it I then bring our cover and ensure that we fit it back into its position then press press all through so we then tighten those screws then tighten those screws firmly firmly this and this also ensuring that it is firm so once that is done we can now then check open and check and see how our laptop is by pressing the power button to see how it goes on and that's it for this video Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for being part of the Opodoti Vast Solutions. In case you've learned something, kindly hit that subscription button and subscribe to our channel. See you soon in the next video. Opodoti Vast Solutions to Excellency. Cheers.